hi beauties welcome back to my channel my name is Yonyozi Prim and thank you so much for being here so so I've had um, I've added some items to my routines my entire you know routine and life and everything and i just felt like i would you know share with you guys and see what are we introducing so that i don't just bump things <laughs> into you guys and i just decided to organize everything into categories so that it's very easy for us to go into what is what first of all i apologize for my hair but it's just that my hair and lack of makeup on the face but it's just that i can't I can't look nice every day like one of the reasons I don't shoot videos a lot is because I, I have to go through a whole makeup process and I feel like that's not that's a very small limiting factor to hold me back from doing good content so today I'm just showing up with just my bare face my bare skin and a touch of lip lipstick and yeah I'm happy so I'm just going to do this anyway I just like want to show you guys the categories before we delve in and then we can start what goes where what did we add on what so that with time I can review some of the products that we got today and tell you guys what's working what's not working what are we ditching what are we staying with that kind of thing right so let me just show you guys what's happening here so these are the items um, perfume body and skin body and you know skincare shoes health you know all that so i want to start with body because you are going to know me okay so i've been meaning to support ugandan brands and i successfully did that with this um between like a few weeks i put out a call on my instagram got some brands um like some brands reached out i bought some items and yeah i've added them to my shower routine and i'm loving them so we are going to start with shower gels so this shower gel is from itoto itoto shower gel and i wanted to first use it because i plan i got this item so that i can do a shower video like a shower routine uh show you guys what i do you know like a lux bath and whatnot so i got and i wanted to support some ugandan brands so this is from itoto this cost i think twelve thousand, if i remember correctly and i like this because when i used it actually it's what i've been using for the past three days like ever since i got it i've been using it consistently because the scent is not very strong uh so for like pregnant women what if you don't like sense this one is not so scented and that's what i like about it uh they say that it's mint scent and for me i didn't honestly i like i feel like it's a very subtle scent which i liked you know which i really loved then um i also got some shower gel from this is isen feel essential it's also a ugandan product it's made in uganda this one the scent is actually pronounced it's not very 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 strong but it's pronounced like you can smell it it says lotus shower gel and it's very it's there it's pronounced this was i think forty five thousand, if i'm not mistaken and what else have i introduced to body okay i also got some body oil right here from me time by shins it's also a ghanan brand this was also forty five thousand. it has vanilla and sandalwood i feel like sandalwood just keeps following me i'll, I'll show you other products that, I, that have sandalwood in them that i i recently acquired for myself so this is vanilla and sandalwood and it's from me time by shins obviously i don't know if you guys where you are things are getting it actually it didn't it didn't have a scent which is a very good thing i really don't like scented products oh it's actually there but it's just subtle anyway things are getting you know bad for like us in entebbe what one thing i know is that it's getting very dry like it's you know it's giving dry skin and whatnot so you really need to moisturize your bodies you need to invest in oil it's getting you know like dry and sunny and whatnot so it's very important that you invest in oil see i like how it has made my hands like shiny and soft um yeah this is something i like for in a moisturizer this is something i like in a body oil yeah this looks nice right this looks just like healthy and fed yeah drink water yeah those things eh? mm, we need to take care of our bodies because the weather is changing um let me so this is skin and bath i think i'm done with bath so i'm going to do with hair so for hair i got um an anti 
dandruff clarifying shampoo with apple cider vinegar clove and hibiscus now this one i got from my workmate uh, i just like wanted to support her brand and she bought me this and she also brought me this this is cloves moisture intensive leave-in conditioner yeah this is from the same brand it's a new it's a new business it's a very small business they're just starting out it's a young business and i wanted to support her so i got these two products for my hair i've been using the shampoo i've used the shampoo twice and i've used this also twice and i like them i like that the scent is not that strong what i don't know about how you know how they improve hair and everything because i really don't have the greatest quality of hair but i like I like using the products and I like to support a small brand. So, um, then, oh, I forgot to tell you guys. I also got myself some, you know, uh, gloves, eh? some scrubbing gloves. These ones I got from the Tuwayo market yesterday, Saturday. Um, it was 20,000, but I've seen some, I've seen uh, different stores having them at like 5,000, what? But I got them at 20,000 because, well, the other stores, they were already available. Anyway, so from that, now these are things that I use in the bathroom. So I just like wanted to finish that category and just like go somewhere else. I've also updated recently and decided to get myself to invest in like a very good deodorant that has proven to be so good. I'm just, you know, those things that you use and you're just like, how do I go back to being normal? Yeah, so this is a deodorant from Donna Karan. This, um, I'm trying to see if the full camera can focus okay yeah and it keeps you dry you guys these children i got three of them a friend of mine was traveling back so whatever you see that i've not gotten in uganda is it's because she helped me bring them back she's traveling back from the u.s and i sent her for these items because yeah they tend to be you know quite cheaper on their end because they are the manufacturers um than getting them here because well there's import tax added and everything so anyway she just like kind, was very kind enough to add this for me in her suitcase and this is a really good ad if you see someone moving in the background that's my cleaning lady please do not think that we have a haunted house um anyway this this is this is really dry and i'm just like you know you use something good and you're just like oh my god where am i going to get the next one from where we did come from will i afford it that kind of anxiety i'm just like will i go back to to you know other deals but this is really really good it's um it's a stick on it's a it's a stick sorry so you just like roll and you know open yeah it's it smells i feel like it smells like powder and that's what i like about it, it smells like powder keeps you dry all day i've worn it twice and i've been you know dry all those days um another thing that i've introduced is now this is from this is mizani miracle length and someone told me that i should try this for my edges i got this from um wisteria salon uh oh it's now going into my face but anyway i'm using this on my edges day and morning and if it works you guys obviously will be seeing results and i will be sharing obviously my journey and my progress it has castor oil hair it says hairline and root stimulator lotion stimulant and it's water based she told me that the reason she gave me this is that it's water based see that it's see okay i don't want to waste it but yeah it's water based it's not oily and i'll be telling you guys how this goes yeah another thing that i got um, in our previous in our previous video, you guys remember when I had discovered a place for waxing in Entebbe? <sighs> Friends, it was terrible. It was absolutely terrible. The lady burnt me so much. My underarms were peeling. I'm going to put a photo like here and, and you'll see. Because even I saw that photo and I was just like... Because I could not wear bras for like two, three days. Like I would be in pain. You know where the metal sits like on the side? I was in so much pain. She burnt my bikini area as well so i had to get something to help with like the bumps because now i have bumps and that's something that i didn't have before so now i have bumps and i had to get myself 10 skin this is a product that you should you know check out its reviews on on, on youtube it's i saw amazing reviews so when brenda was traveling back i just told her to please help me it says um it's a skincare solution to ingrown hairs red up razor bumps shaving stroke waxing and it's cruelty free so it can also be used by men on their beards you know men who get bumps I 
after shaving on their beards this is good for you i've seen good reviews and i'll also be telling you because honestly as we speak i have a huge bump literally on the entrance of my vagina because of waxing and i'll be using this and i'll be letting you guys know i also have bumps in the underarms i'll be letting you know then another thing that i've added for my underarms another thing that i've added for my underarms that it was much needed i feel like i had made so much progress with you know like helping to like brighten them now please note this is not something that's you know like so important to me because i feel like there's friction in the world when your arms rub obviously there's friction it's like having dark inner thighs like, it's not something i obsess about like if it works well and good if it doesn't i'm also okay but i've introduced this um the ordinary glycolic acid this is the seven percent uh this is seven percent toning solution and and I'm also I intended to add this for uh, let me see come okay yeah I intended to add this for my underarms because it helps for brightening I've so far used it twice so I used it yesterday but one and last night as well because I feel like uh, you know uh, it helps when I bathe in the evening I remove you know remove that deal when you're showering then I put this yeah I also know that some people say that they use it as deodorant and instead of using deodorant so this i will also be letting you guys know i'll show you before and after pictures for this but i know that it's a very good product for the underarms and it also helps with um some some you know body order what 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 i i i, I, I intend to do a more detailed video on underarm care and like body order and all that so that's where we'll talk about this more okay yeah so that's another thing that i've introduced okay now we are going to move on to um like some like a moisturizer or something or you know like lip balm and what like you know like as if skincare something that i'm using another thing that i've introduced is this hand cream from itoto itoto is like a ugandan brand they're the makers of the shower gel that i showed you guys it's a hand cream and like i said guys i've been noticing that for me my hands and fingers are like 50 years old well me I am a born of 1997 i'm kidding anyway my under my my hands have been you know aging really fast and they've been dry and just cracky so i feel like if i work on them maybe something will be different like they'll they'll change so i decided to get myself some hand cream and this is from itoto ug so now when we move on to face when we move on to the face um and and let's say the lips i got um a strawberry scrub sugar lip scrub from dapa dapa is a ugandan brand and this is a pr product i didn't pay for this so they sent me this i intend to be using it when i'm because i know that when you wear um when you wear matte lipstick sometimes they tend to chop your lips after so i want to be able to use this it's a lip scrub uh, this is a ugandan brand and it's a PR product. This is also a PR product. I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to use it. It's Shea Fairy um, Super Critical Omega 3 Shea Face Shea Face Oil. Um, so I'm already taking some Omega 3 tablets, not for uh, for like my wellness and whatnot. So I want. I fear adding new things to my face. It freaks me out so much. So I'm not going to lie. I won't use this. I won't use this but i got myself some estee Lauder advanced night repair i want to use this on days when i wear makeup because i feel like lately my face is just not giving like my skin I, I like to keep my skin really nice so that you know first of all you can't cover you know blemishes with makeup reason being that makeup sits well on good skin so it's very important that you take your, care of your skin first so i feel like it's i've been wearing makeup back and forth back and forth a lot because i've been having so many events in the past like two three weeks so i want to first repair it because i want to look nice without makeup on and i don't like these things that are here you see like this then i have some things here yeah that so i got myself this for night um i want to use it only at night i know it says that um apply on clean skin before your moisturizer am and pm but i only want to use it at night after you know i've worn makeup i don't want to use it a lot because i don't think i'll be able to get it anytime soon because i'm going to help me bring it and so i want to only use it like say three times a week and i'll tell you guys how that goes what it improves and another thing that i've added to my skincare is this now this is also a ugandan this is um a ugandan i've also seen it in kenya they have products in uganda and in kenya and in uganda they're called 
aspire one while in kenya it's biobalance kenya so i found them at um a pulse for high event that i attended yesterday and they had this discoloration free so i, I told myself you know what let me just try it like it won't hurt to try it i fear introducing new products to my skin but the lady says that it's organic and it's good so i'm like okay i hope you know it didn't like spoil me because i told her i'm very allergic to like vitamin c i'm not good for vitamin c so it says dark spots and even skin tone brightness enhancer deep hydration lumi skin four percent um it says super serum discoloration free lumi skin four percent dark spot corrector pigmentation control so the reason i bought it is for this part that you guys see here and the truth is it has really come a long way i'll show you how it used to be before i think i have a before photo and i'll show and now you see hey eh, like the difference i'm going to look for that before photo and put it somewhere here and you see how it has really improved because i've been using glycolic acid i know vitamin c is also good for bright but I didn't know that for me it's not good for me because the moment I use it I get acne breakouts like really really terrible black breakouts so I used to get pimples those like huge pimples that don't come out of the skin and then they just like go after and they're painful itchy then after they go and leave very dark spots so this and this side as well so I'm going to try and use this discoloration free she told me to use it at night and then after I'll tell you guys i'll give you guys a review because i know that this is something that so many of us struggle with uh hyperpigmentation especially we you know women of color who struggle with hyperpigmentation it is let me just show you guys how the serum looks like so that i can actually even throw away the box because i won't need it this is it this is how it looks like i don't know if i'm supposed to keep it in like a dark place because i know that um that that's what vitamin c is supposed to be kept in like a dark place directions of use ap apply directly to cleansed face morning evening allow serum to be absorbed into skin before applying your moisturizer okay warnings for external use only avoid keep out of reach of children note the sun friendly ingredients of this serum won't increase your skin's sensitivity to the sun however staying away from the sun is imperative to prevent the triggering of melanin production therefore it is suggested to use spf 50 plus sunscreen wear protective clothing and limit sun exposure to see quick results do i live in africa friend do i live in the tropics where the sun comes out every morning can we avoid the sun can we are we about to turn into vampires for the skin we'll see anyway so i think that's what i've added to face that's what i've added to face maybe now what i've added to oral actually these have come in time that they're like they really come in at the perfect time because the ones i had had grown old and i'd thrown them, them away so i was just too lazy to get others but the lord sent an angel in terms of diana who sent me these you know i didn't pay for this she just sent me these and i'm just like really you know grateful 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 um these are tongue scrapers or tongue cleaners you know that are very important in oral hygiene i also intend to do like a deep oral hygiene video okay then speaking of oral let us also do the lip and lippies and we move so this i got from dapper i'd actually this is not a pr product i'd gotten this a while back on the mona Masterclass. um i saw people wearing this like it's one of the present one of the gifts i think they had used or one of the lippies they had used on the models and it was such a very nice brown color like deep rich what this is a ugandan brand and i decided to get myself this gloss however i'd not gotten time to you know pick it from the store okay and I also got myself, you know, uh, Nuba. I know that you guys know Nuba, but um, Nuba or Noba, whichever way you pronounce it. However, I know that if there's, there's, there's a time that they made so many fakes on the market. So many. So many of us stopped um, wearing it. Until recently, um, Claret was doing my makeup and she had Nuba. And I was very shocked that she had good Nuba. She, you know, she was putting it on me and I was just like, you know, skeptical. What? Then I was like, okay, let me just wear it until the end of the day. And I see. Because what it used to do to me is that it would chop my lips immediately. At the end of the day, my lips would be having such red wounds and it would be so bad so i know what let us use it and we see she told me this is a good one this is um this is not a chup this is not a fake and yeah i told i asked her where she got it from and she told me she got it from duvo effect 
and that's the whole effect on instagram these are there um i don't know if the camera is focusing the whole effect um on instagram i will tag most of the brands that i will leave links to most of the brands that i've you know i've mentioned and yeah i'm wearing nuba right now which is this one it's 46 it's an amazing color to be very honest with you i won't lie i've missed it and yeah I, I ordered it and i think the lady took like a month to get it because i found it like it was out of stock when i ordered it but she took like a month and she got back to me i think it was about eighty thousand. so she also uh duvo effect also gave me some mascara uh this is a product this is a pair product i did not pay for this she just added for me some uh this is the mascara right here let me actually let me take it out of the book guys why am i being an african here we are here we are yeah let's just put that out of the box and i think she added um something else she also has oh yeah this is liquid eyeliner this is also made by her this is also yeah this is made by her this is how it looks like and it's from duvo effect liquid eyeliner okay uh this is this i also didn't pay for this was also a pr product um so i think we are done with that so another thing that that oh my god i just remembered i forgot to add to show you guys on the shower routine shower and body routine is a towel like you are like this this towel is from quasar quasar home it's very important to me that um like that's why i'm, I'm like talking about it you must feel like a zine why are you talking about a towel in a video but it's just that it's very hard to find towels that are big enough as a plus size girl so i've been getting my towels from owino but i've not had time or like a minute to go down and i had told quasar home to help me get one this is her i'm also going to leave you know like a link to her instagram so she got me two towels she got me a gray one and a maroon one and they're really big like they go around my body let me see if i can like stand up and show you guys and they are they like dry so well they they're very comfortable see this and they're very long like up to these ends so that's another item that i've added to the shower and body routines that is giving okay so let me just place it here then we now go into um i think we can do perfume yeah we can do perfume that's okay we can do perfume so i got i got myself this juicy couture i saw good reviews about it on youtube so when i was updating my perfume collection it's called viva la juicy and i decided to add you know this um i also got myself replica i i don't know this is like a cute small just minimalistic brand it's you know like it's not a small brand it's a big brand anyway but i love the perfume i don't know how to describe perfumes i will not even lie with that whole oh bagamo oba bichi bichi oba what not so i do not know what lord help all of us but this is called um by the fireplace um it's described as burning wood and chestnut and it's from i cannot pronounce the name but it's mason magela or magela whatever so anyway this this i think is by far my favorite of all that I, I think i got myself about four perfumes so this must be by far my favorite because i love how it smells it actually smells like burning you know like wood or it's like there's some i don't know if you guys know like that tree of modala sin it's like there's a tree of modala sin in there i know what modala sin is in english is it cinnamon it's like there's a, like like burning cinnamon anyway this one is by far my favorite so this is something else that i got and i got this from this is christian uh christian dio um this i like and I, I honestly cannot be describing for you the sense because that would not be me i'd be lying i'm not when did i become that bougie yeah i saw so good reviews on this one and yeah that's why i bought it um this is also a favorite this is peony and blush by joe malone and 
I love it. It's like, you know, there are some perfumes that just grow on you when, you know, you spray it on your body. It takes like a minute to sit in and everything. This is not one of them. This one sits in just like immediately. Like, if you, like you smell, you get the scent immediately as soon as you spray it on your body. And I love that. I love that. I love Jo Malone. So we also got some for... Um, i got some perfumes for my partner this one we are just refilling because he's been using this and i love i really he smells nice with it like it's a really really good scent for men it's called aqua aqua dj uh that's jojo Armani, and this is one of the best scents for men um i would advise that if you're looking for a scent what yeah this is this is really good i know that yeah he's been using it it's an amazing scent but i also added him some scents I got him this Amani cord. Um, I've seen good reviews because for perfume, for, for male perfumes, honestly, I don't know them so much. So I just had to rely on reviews by male. There's a gentleman who reviews male perf who reviews perfumes on YouTube, and I follow him, and he reviewed this one as one of the best perfumes for men. It's a good perfume, and then I have a friend of mine called Penny who also told me the same thing. She also likes she also likes this one. Yeah. Then um, I also got him. Uh, a YSL I cannot pronounce to pronounce the word but the goal is to afford not to pronounce words okay there's also this this one I'll be letting you know guys because when I smell it right now I even get headache so I'll let you know I'll let you know if you know how it sits I'm going to ask him to wear this like alone and then I smell it then um, I got him some perfumes for layering with his you know like the major perfumes and we just got like you know like dupes of like original perfumes now this is like a dupe for jo malone this is for layering this is a dupe for jo malone but it has a really really nice scent i used this one the other day i sprayed it on myself and yeah the scent was nice this is also a dupe and it has woody sandalwood yeah, this is the next time. This is the other time we're getting sandalwood. But anyway, these two are for layering with the other. Um, how many perfumes did we get him for, with the other like three perfumes? Yeah, these two are for layering with the other three perfumes, and yeah, that's it for perfume. So we now move on to um, jewelry or jewelry or jewelry or whatever you want to call it. Um, I decided to get myself um, so first of all this my friend has been um, organizing a trip for a while so I bought most of these things like uh, like uh, some time back and we just sent them to her house she's just like moving back with them so I got myself some Swarovski crystals I got Swarovski Swarovski's crystals these are from um, Farfetch I don't know if you guys know that brand but it sells like some pre-loved items and some new items it's very beautiful so i got myself some swarovski and these are you know like yeah crystal hard like earrings which i think are really like cute and just complement your look they give me those as in each of the pairs that i got actually just gives me those rich vibes of like a low sleek low burn and yeah like i wish i had like edges and i just like slick my hair to the back then i can like just wear these earrings like that's the vibes those are the vibes i'm getting from every pair i love these i've not owned silver earrings in like a minute but i really like these i like that they are minimal and just like classy because that's what i was going for um yeah yeah this this is cute this is actually very cute i know what you guys think i love these this is the packaging which i think was very cute these were actually affordable like you can save and just like afford them so that's um this this must have been like i think there's a pair that was more expensive than the others i don't know if it was this one uh, must have been like about um 187 and the other two pairs must have been like at 100 and 100 i am not so sure but i will check the link and our chats and then I will update in case anyone is interested. These are for Versace. Um, yeah, like I like to, like I, I don't know you guys, like for the longest time that you'll be here or the short time you'll be here, you realize that I like to invest in a good piece. These also give me those like classy vibes of, you know, like closely ponytail, what, and yeah, we move. So one of these pairs 
customers two of these pairs were like a hundred a hundred and you might ask yourself why i'm spending that much on jewelry well it's because i bought um jewelry before and it fades so it's that whole thing of i've decided to do that whole cost per wear because like how much um because i know that there are times you buy jewelry and then it just like fades and then you have to buy again and then and gain and again and you find that you come to the price that i've spent at once so as long as something i like to invest in timeless quality bags that's something that i've decided to do for myself ever since like i turned 30 um i try to buy like really really good pieces timeless pieces bit clothes bit shoes especially bags and, and bags and jewelry i try to invest in like good pieces so another kalito thing i got for myself are these earrings from ysl um okay uh this is the certificate uh saint moro paris yeah it's like i don't know why they were writing it. like okay Jewelry is born of the creativity and expertise of master craftsmanship to, to preserve its shine. We recommend the following. I avoid direct contact with any cosmetic or chemical products, perfume, chlorine, and water. I know that perfume has spoiled a necklace of mine that I got from a jewelry, like a really nice necklace. Perfume is really not good for your but perfume is not good for your necklaces and for you know for your earrings, not good for jewelry because yeah. And then water and chlorine. Handle jewelry with care and protect it from impact. Store jewelry carefully and separately in its original pouch. Yeah, that's something that I've also like when I buy my, you know, my my good pieces. I always keep them in, you know, in the places in the bags that they came with, and that's how I manage to preserve them. I do that with my LV earrings and my Fendi earrings. I just always keep them in their box. Um, so please avoid putting perfume. You know how you wear you wear your earrings and then you just like spray. Shoo, please avoid that. Um, avoid if you can um chlorine or you know like other chemical products that you don't understand they are just like never good for your pieces and that's how you preserve them at least even me i know that anyway i don't know if these are intended to be like different sizes is i don't know if it's the fashion or there was like a mistake made but well it's too late we're in uganda i don't know how to do to send them back like i can't send them back but i wanted a pair of like cute pearls obviously these are not like original pearls because original pearls are so so expensive but these are like from ysl and they just like have the logo written on them right there i don't know if the camera is going to to you know focus but they're like small tiny pieces um of like off-white you know pearls 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 yeah that's the other like piece of jewelry that i got myself so there's another brand that i discovered i've been looking for bangles like i want to wear bangles i feel like these are where they make the look just hmm? i've been looking at bangles on pinterest looking 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 for a brand that can give me good ones and i wasn't like really finding finding them until i landed on this brand it's called nature the label but the nature is spelled with a k at the beginning it's like this it's like this so anyway it says the card says thank you for your order nature is an ethical and sustainable brand that is constantly innovating and evolving we honor the alchemy of you it's actually like a bohemian or gypsy like you know label and it even says somewhere in there like uh website hello gypsy bk.com so i got myself a letter I, I got myself a necklace that has letter m m is for my other name which is morunji i'm going to just try and bring this back i feel like this most of this jewelry is made from like um uh brass it's brass and then coated with gold like 4k gold 14k gold or like 18k i'm not so sure but yeah back to the bangles i love the packaging this is the packaging it has like two sections in here like generally two bedrooms this is a two bedroom house so it has um these bangles are heavy like the gold is shiny and they are heavy and this is what i've been looking for like i wanted to just wear like say you know like two of them or like wear one of them and just like you see how they make this shirt pop see this is what i was going for so i got myself four bangles and this is i got myself because when you go to the website there's like a size i think medium s to m and then there's i think or m to l i'm not so sure but i got myself large because i remember when i was asking me are you sure you want large what if they are too big but well I cannot be having tiny arms as an African woman. Anyway, these are the bangles. And I love the colors, guys. I really love the colors. I hope the camera, you know, shows just how shiny the gold is. I love it. I love it. So, nature the world, the label, if anyone sees this, well done. 
yeah <laughs> i'm not going to take them off let me just have them on but anyway i feel like we're going to make so much noise in this video so let me just take them off and again please do not sh throw away the storage bags because they are important they are needed so that's how you preserve your jewelry and please please when you spray perfume for example on your hands let it first sit in before you can put on your bangles i know that that also helps them to, that helps you to preserve them for longer okay we are done with i think jewelry because i put that in a different section we are done with that let me see there's nothing left yeah this is the bag that i got for yeah this is from this is the bag this is the certificate for the versace earrings this is the tag from farfetch please keep this label attached for returns i will not be returning i love everything this is how the things came and now we are going to move to a very important um important pieces of a woman's body body that's underwear i got myself some underwear from i don't know if you guys have seen like lizzo's drop yeti yeah there's a time they had sale there's a time yeti had sales and i think like this panties were going for like i think 20 dollars if i'm not mistaken and that's when i got myself some so I got myself some leggings and some panties from Yeti, and this is one of them, a high waist black panty. I like the stretch. It actually has like a stretch and, and like as if a tight band. So I like that I can wear this daily on like jeans, what, and they don't have to like, you know, they double as a body shaper. This as well. This is like a body shaper thong panty. This one, I got it in black and in brown, which is this these two then let me show you um i got myself some leggings from it as well they are transparent but then one of the, like when i saw this i was just so excited um this this is the first drop of it so they have a panty inside see here this is a panty inside yeah then they are transparent down 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 there are times i have like uh you see that you see that the panty ends somewhere yeah when i hold that in the light yeah so there are times i have like a long shirt and i want to wear it with like you know transparent leggings what anyway as a fat girl you need to have leggings regardless of what in your life but these um now these are maternity leggings from one of the best brands in the entire world for like spanks and leggings and you know for women's bodies that brand is spanks see i have um, a pair of leggings from spanks that fit me at all sizes like when i'm like when i lose weight they are there when i gain weight they're there and they're the ones that i wore for the, the patent leather pants i will find a link for them and leave it somewhere here it was a very good worthy investment very very worthy investment so these leggings are definitely a worthy investment i got a size 2xl which is 2 2x 2g which is um in europe it's 54 to 56 in hips i'm like a 54 then uh uk it's 28 to 30 there's france then there's it it i don't know what it is whether it's italy or whatever but anyway i love this is spanks by sarah blakely I love um, Spanx because there's even a time she like last year she gave bonuses to her workers and like flew them abroad what and I feel like I like to support such first of all female owned brands and brands that treat their workers well and like give back to them so do you see how small these leggings are guys imagine imagine how small they are they stretch to fit me that's how my leather leggings are they are small but they also stretch to fit me can you believe when they say this is size 2x guys 2x but it looks like this is a maternity that means i wear them even when i'm pregnant so they allowed for that because i didn't want to just like get ordinary leggings what what i wanted something that is very long term like my money has to you know like serve you get so that's what i mean by you know like staple pieces and everything so these leggings very worthy investment each time i wear them i will like guys cost per wear these ones well done sparks um now i also got myself some sandals now i want you guys to know that i used to be so insecure about my feet like i would never i didn't have sandals i never had sandals i have not had sandals for years anyway 
um i've not had sandals for like years guys because i've been very insecure about my toes but anyway um i got myself some sandals from zara and also got my mom some like three pairs but there's a pair that didn't fit and i'm going to be setting that off but i got let me show you guys what i got um this one is not from zara this one my friend told me that she went to a warehouse because i was looking for like back in stocks but you know back in stocks are so expensive like 200 dollars or something like that so i was getting back in stocks for my mom because you know how they are very soft and everything so anyway she didn't my, we, 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 we like decided not to buy them until my friend went to like a warehouse somewhere in the u.s and found these i don't know what she i don't remember what she called that warehouse but we found these and they were for my mom but i decided to keep them for myself me and bobuna both think they look nice on me um but here are the zara sandals i think the packaging is just like very cute like there um this is the first time i'm getting myself sandals guys and i cannot like just believe it because oh i finally decided and realized that these feet are not going anywhere i wore this yesterday when i wore like some nice bougie orange dress so I'm, i got these ones because they're, like they're you know like gold and silver you see like a silver strap and i got this for days when i want, I want to like just feel so bougie with like nice well manicured toes and everything these are the ones um these i wore yesterday we need to clean them so i won't be putting them the package is so cute so i'm not i'm not throwing it away i'm not putting in that back the shoes either because it's white but i'm also not throwing it away i feel like i could i will find some something to use it for but i also got myself this the, the reason i got brown is that it's neutral it's a neutral color you can wear them anywhere on anything most times in most cases and i didn't want to buy, buy black because it's a bit basic but um one of the tricks that i want to teach you guys is that ankle sandals are good for people who have my kinds of legs my legs are sort of big up and then smaller down but ankle sandals come and balance out that and your legs end up looking as if even from like top to bottom that's why i invest so much in ankle sandals and they're just like smart and bougie and they have like a cushioning here for your feet what yeah so cute cute then um i just got myself like um three pairs because i don't again i also don't like just to exaggerate and have so many things um yeah i also got myself this so i just wanted to get myself some ankle sandals and then these for you know just like in a hurry you need to step into something and just like run to the stores or drive or whatever this is it this is what i decided to go with um then we now move to health and fitness yeah so for health and fitness um of let i decided to start like you know packing some meals to work or to different places so that um i'm not i'm forced not to you know like first of all buy out because well the economy and then also to like just be able to eat the meals that i've prepped for myself because i know you know whatever i use to cook the food and this came in handy this is actually a because when i talked about it on my instagram someone sent me a present diana uh sent me this cute you know car bag that can help me preserve my food it's as if like a thermos in there and yeah keep it warm and i'm really grateful and it's portable so i can carry it you know with me then i also um got like uh i've also like been you know like working out but mainly skipping the rope but now i have like a yoga map mat from like actually a ugandan brand called um called afro can fit this is it first of all i like how she packages the mat like you can carry it anywhere like you can put it in your car and just go wherever you're supposed to go so that's like really 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 a plus it has a knot for you to open like this and then keep it when you are done portable enough for you to carry to wherever you're going and this i'm amazed by uh sorry i don't know what fell down there um, sorry friends sorry friends sorry friends i'm just like opening one last thing and also she gave me like um a tape major which is this um anyway 
and it goes back like that um i think that's it that brings us to the end of this video and whatever i've talked about that i'm going to try for example the tent skin the hairline um products that i got the glycolic acid i promise to come back and give you guys honest reviews thank you so much for watching and please see you next time please click the like button if you liked this video please give it a thumbs up and please subscribe in case you've not yet subscribed honestly i love having a small community um i love having this like youtube place i feel like it's a refuge because my other social media you know pages have blown up but i like that this one is still small and we can like just talk about things i love reading your comments so please leave a comment i love responding i love interacting with each and every one of you so um please keep it here and i'm very very grateful have a very